For Alice. This is extremely alarming. They're inducting across the We gotta destroy these bastards before they kill all of us. We soaked in things. And we torched them. I mean, to think this fucker was watching over my kids? They, they rushed the police and they, they slaughtered them. Those things are monsters. How do you feel? I'm hot and cold at the same time. Stay with her. I'll try to find this Marcus. The last bus is in two hours. And the terminal's on the other side of town. We haven't got much time. We'll leave as soon as we have passports. Lots of time to talk on the bus. I'll be back. Stay with Alice. Following the Android crisis and the neutralization of all military androids, American forces and the Arctic have been forced to withdraw, leaving the way clear for the Russian army. But according to some sources, the Russian forces yeah, also seem mysteriously to have withdrawn. Gremlin has made no comment for the moment, but it is quite possible that the Russian army has been confronted with a similar crisis among its own androids. The chairman of the United Nations, Douglas Cromwell, has called for the organization of an international conference on the status of the Arctic. In any case, the danger of a third world war seems to have been ruled out for the moment. There was a veritable groundswell of violence in Detroit this morning. Several There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. Maybe you should stay here a while. Thanks for the offer. But we won't leave now. One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports he can easily modify. I'll have him get them to you. Thank you. You said you're with a little girl, right? You know that humans hate us. Why are you protecting her? I don't care whether she's human or android. She's just someone who matters to me.
just didn't want to see it. She wanted a mom. And you wanted someone to care for. You needed each other. What difference does it make? Do you love her any less? I'm so surprised. I didn't know that was a thing. It's now that you know she's one of us. Alice loves you, Carol. She loves you more than anything in the world. Did and you became the mother she needed. Forgetting who you are to become what someone needs you to be. Maybe that's what it means to be alive. I'm back. Kara, is there something wrong? family now. Family. We're short on blue blood and bio components. Our wounded are shutting down and there's nothing we can do. Present war. Germany. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. It's a disaster. They're slaughtering our people. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. We couldn't just suffer in silence. They're killing us. Nothing is going to justify that. It was a peaceful march, and you chose to attack. Now hundreds of humans and androids are dead. You reap what you sow. You keep complaining. What have you done exactly, Josh? At least I fought for us. At least if I die, I die free. We shouldn't forget who our enemies are. We can't fight amongst ourselves. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. 
Marcus? I need to think. They've been butchering each other for centuries over the color of their skin or whatever god they wanted to worship. They're not going to change. Violence is just in their genes. They can't stop what we've started. Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. I convinced him not to do it. To give me the detonator. A dirty bomb. We can't lose this war, Marcus. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive if things go wrong. I just hope we never have to use it. Whatever happens tomorrow, I just want you to know that I... I'm glad I met you. Look after yourself. I don't want to lose you. This is what we could have done if we had Connor. Probably kill all of them. There's another way. Maybe if you didn't take Luke there, then that's what that one was. We basically did everything but one thing. That might be being not meeting Marcus. And that's the other one. And it would have led up to you. And down where I was. Up here it would have been like that and then you would have a much longer if you did the other option, kind of. Alright. And we only did a short one. Like, we could have done a massive one over here. Uh, continue. 2038. Where's Marcus at? Alarm deactivated. Welcome home, Marcus. Car. The house will have changed. 
I don't know what this does. These stairs do not have this on it. Did he get broke? Why did he get broke? Why is it? Who are you? How did you get in? I need to see Carl. Carl isn't seeing anyone. You need to leave. Please. I need to see him. He's very weak. I'm not sure he'll be able to talk to you. What's wrong, Marcus? You taught me everything I know, but I wasn't prepared for this. I thought we would win because our cause was just. I realized just how wrong I was. The world is ruled by fear, Marcus. Fear of others. Fear of the future. It's like me, too old. It's time for a damn. Well, what should I do? Carl, they're killing my people. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but tell me, what choice do they give? Being alive is making choices between Love and hate between holding out your hand or closing it as a fist? I don't have any easy answers, Marcus. You have to accept the world as it is. Or fight to change it. You're my son, Marcus. Our blood isn't the same color, but I know part of me is in you. When the world falls into darkness, some men have the courage to lead it out. You're one of those men. Face the abyss, but don't let it consume you. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. Okay. One that very well may determine the future of our people. Yes. Now, if they want war, they'll get it. We are going to fight for our freedom, and we will succeed or die. Are you ready to follow me? Josh, Josh, I don't care if you don't want to do this. Josh, Josh don't want to do this. Josh don't want to fight. Oh, what is it? I'm for color. I of this. This is probably taking the ball. That's why there's like more options here. 
At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Please! Has the leader of the Deviants been apprehended? The Deviant that is known as Marcus has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. Madam President! Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids working on sensitive sites have been neutralized, and all IT systems have been suspended to avoid any risks of hacking. The situation is under control. Madam President! Madam President! What's gonna happen to Cyberlife? Will androids be banned definitively? We're working very closely with Cyberlife to neutralize all deviants. I won't make any comments about anything else until we've dealt with the android question. Madam President! Madam President! Many believe that androids are a new form of intelligent life. Do you have any comment? That's ridiculous. Next question, please. Please! Is it true that a large number of deviants are still on the loose? We don't have the full reports at this time, but if so, I can assure you they will soon be apprehended and destroyed. Thank you. That will be all. They're going door to door rounding up androids. It won't be easy to get through. The last bus leaves in 20 minutes. We've got to move fast. Are you all right? I'm, I'm, I'm really cold. You'll feel better now.
Jarvis. All right. I'll go. You wait here. Let me go, Kara. No. Stay with Alice. Chance I'm gonna die here. Hey, buddy. This is a mistake. I'm human. I, I just want to go home. My wife is expecting me, and we're going to. Got orders to check all civilians. No, no, please. Saved us. We don't know how to thank you. Where's the little one? She's all right. She's hiding nearby. Go before they see you. A checkpoint. We have passports, it should be okay, but you never know. Maybe we should take the detour and avoid the risk. We're almost out of time, we could miss the bus. Yeah, or it might be safer. Choose a vault. Risky three minutes. We can go this way, I don't know where we are from. Okay. 11 minutes, 309 minutes, we're going this way. Say so. ID, please. We do realize there's a curfew. Civilians aren't allowed out unless absolutely necessary. Where are you going? Our car just broke down. We're finishing on foot. We live nearby. He suspects something. Everything is fine. You all right, little girl? She's trembling. Something wrong? She... She's cold. We really have to get her home fast. Sorry, miss, but we gotta be careful. There are deviants around, and our guys are nervous. You should hurry on home. Thanks. Oh, yeah. Hey, wait a minute. He knows, Kara. They're gonna kill us. Don't do anything, Luther. You hear me? They're gonna shoot. They're gonna kill Alice. Do it. Good job. just wanted to give me back this. Today, 
November 11, 2038 is the day the android people rose up against their oppressors. We've been fighting since dawn to liberate our fellow androids from the camps. We won't cease hostilities until we are free and negotiations begin to grant us equal rights. So we kill someone for no point reason. Yay! There are millions of us, and we will stop at nothing. Dallas, we made it. The last bus for the border is full. Ticket holding passengers only. All departures are suspended until further notice. We don't have tickets. They won't let us on. We're stuck here now. What are we going to do? Likes you. Please don't move. Is she yours? Yes. She's adorable. That's it. Got the sandwiches. I called your mom. Let's get going before we miss our bus. You got the tickets, right? Yes, honey, in my bag. Great. Let's go then. Security check. Please don't move. Sorry, I was Shit, dead. I don't believe it. I don't know what happened. You can't have lost them. Did you have a good look in your bag? They were in my backpack. The envelope must have fallen. Fuck. Excuse me, you, you didn't happen to see a blue envelope somewhere, did you? It has our bus tickets in it and... Stay here. We have to find a safe place for Oliver. I'm so sorry, honey. I don't know what Come happened. Else. They were right here in my bag. I... Got your ticket? Yes, here they are. Okay, go ahead.
guys, every single time I play this, I always, there's this boat one, I have to always do that. Like, I never been on the bus one, because I can never find the tickets. So, yeah. Does it never go to that people? Those. I just ran out of time before I find the tickets. A lot of time I have to turn them. And keep them. Yeah. I think this might be the end. Probably. Really want to get on to the boat. And the situation is escalating towards civil war in Detroit, with our armed forces preparing to put down the Android Rebellion. They seem to be headed towards the camps where the androids have been in turns pending destruction. Soldiers have taken up positions around the Hard Plaza camp. Authorities seem to be expecting a confrontation with the rebel androids here at any time. We've got to be fast and overwhelm them. That's our only hope. Shoot them. We're gonna Shoot. do this. Shoot. We're gonna get to that fucking camp and free our people. Be careful, Marcus. Our people need you. Till it's over, okay? All right.
lost a lot of our people. We gotta move faster, or we'll never reach the camp. Excuse me, what's going on? Border control. All passengers must leave the bus. Please move along. <laughs> this way, please. Temperature checks. We're trapped. What are we gonna do, Clara? Don't worry, Alice. We'll be fine. We can't get through, Kara. We both know that. I'll think of something. There's got to be a way out of this. 
We can't let them stop us. Not that we're so close. All that matters now is you and Alice. I can save you, Kara. No. No, find another way. If there's no other way, I'll do it. Jerry? You risked your life to save us, Carl. If you and the little girl need me, I'll be there. Loose and across the border. Where the hell do you think you're going? My daughter needs to go to the bathroom. Terrified, I thought you might have been killed. Oh, thank God you're all right. You're leaving Detroit? They're searching for androids door to door. We had to leave before someone turned us in. What about the others? They're crossing the river as we speak. Adam and I are going to meet them on the other side. Rose. If anything should happen, I'll be there, Kara. What's happening with Marcus? He's attacking one of the android camps as we speak. I don't know if he'll be successful, but violence only leads to violence. He is not successful. <laughs> You gave me your brother's address. Do you think that I... Of course. He'd be delighted to have you. We're going there, too. You'll be safe with him. They're checking for androids. We won't make it through. You have to. You know what they'll do if they catch you. Yeah, I was not going to make it through here.
couldn't understand why my mother wanted to help you guys. Made me realize she was right. I don't agree with what Marcus is doing. But you're alive. You deserve to be free. I just hope people will realize that one day. Next, please. ID? Is she all right? scared anymore, little girl. There are no androids on this side of the border. Welcome to Canada. Oh, yes, we made it. We made it. Yeah. I'm so nervous. I was not meant to be. I was so nervous. Oh, good point, mate. Sad that Jerry times. But the cop could have shot him that We have you surrounded. Come out now. I repeat. Come out now with your hands in the air. If you surrender now, we will not shoot. There has just been an explosion in Detroit. We still do not know what caused it, but we will... We have many unconfirmed reports, but we have no official news on exactly what it is at this time. Explosion in the south of Detroit. We still don't know if there are any victims, but these events may be linked to the Android Rebellion currently taking place in it's the city. a dirty bomb, Madam President. My God. And the authorities have ordered the immediate evacuation of the city. If it really is a dirty bomb, then the radiation levels will be lethal for miles around. Detroit. Detroit has just fallen into the hands of the Android Rebellion. This is a disaster. An unprecedented disaster. Today, deviant androids triggered a dirty bomb in Detroit. This bomb released fatal levels of radioactive toxic waste. To ensure the safety of the population, the military is evacuating all civilians within a 50 mile radius. 
the city may remain uninhabitable for decades. This is the first time in our history that one of our cities has fallen into enemy hands. We are going to fight them with all our strength, and we won't rest until we have taken back control of Detroit and destroyed the last of them. Humanity is about to face its most important battle, one that will lead to our victory or our extinction. We... May God bless you all. Are... And may God bless the United States of America. Free! No matter what, they would have all died. This is the end. I think this is the end.